Hello, everybody. This is Tamara from Croatia. Um, you can notice that I have um, a piece of paper <laughs> with the questions that we need to answer. So uh, how did you team up? Uh, I noticed that Mirta made uh, the Padlet group and I decided to uh, team up with Mirta because Padlet uh, is familiar to me. Uh, then, did you face any challenges as a team member? If so, what challenges did you face? Of course, I uh, faced challenges. Um, what types? Well, um, as a child, as I was growing up, um, I um, um, wasn't used to working in a pair, or we were not taught to work in a pair or in a group. Um, so the greatest challenge was to um, be patient and to be tolerant, to wait until all the team members uh, finished with their activities, to carry on. What challenges do you expect your students to face and how will you deal with them? Well, maybe the greatest challenge uh, for my students would be um, to ask them to have their own uh, Gmail accounts, because some of them don't have Gmail accounts. Then uh, they will also have to be patient and tolerant, um, as I have been. And, of course, uh, um, I will have to probably repeat what they have to do. I will maybe have to um, um, explain um, the activities several times because there are students in my um, um, classes who have problems. They uh, have um, problems with reading, listening, and so on and so on. So what did you learn about yourself as you worked? Well, I've learned that I don't like uh, recording myself because usually I have to um, take at least two or three or five recordings. <clears throat> and the other problem was that I've noticed that my day um, isn't long enough to uh, do all the activities that I have to do. Uh, not just for this course, but of course for my work and my family life and so on and so on. So how will you use Google Docs, slides and forms with your students? I've already explained uh, one of my um, activities uh, that are due uh, this uh, Valentine's Day. I asked uh, the students to, um, to make a presentation um, each group will do one slide about the greatest love couples in the world. This is one uh, activity. Um, then uh, I have already uh, used uh, Google Forms for service and for assessment. So uh, these are um, the activities that I will probably keep on doing. Uh, but I can also, um, well, mention one activity that just um, crossed my mind. Uh, maybe while um, uh, doing the text and uh, to, let's say, see how much the students understood of the text. Each group can, for example, do their own Google form and then they can exchange links. Okay, it's been fun uh, doing this EVO course. Thank you all so much. Bye!